Well, we all know that phones come in different shapes, sizes, and price points, but typically, if you want a large phone, you gotta pay a big premium price. Well, today, we're gonna show a large phone that won't break your bank. Yeah, it's the Sony Xperia XA1 Ultra, and it's six inches and costs less than 500 bucks. Yeah, and you know what? There's not a lot of six inches phones on the market today, but this one kind of fits the bill, and it's under that Xperia brand, meaning you're gonna get that Xperia form factor. And just by looking at this, I'm just gonna grab this from Sherry, you can see that they've gone for a very square, rectangular design. Most typical phones have curves on the edges. Well, the Xperia line has always typically had this type of square design. Very boxy, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And under the hood, it's, it, is, uh, it does have enough juice for you to do your daily tasks. It has four gigs of RAM. Yep. Uh, it has a MediaTek MT6757 uh, Helio processor, so that's not the usual Snapdragon. Um, it does have a 2700 milliamp battery. Yeah. So uh, with the screen size and the battery, you're looking at maybe a day's worth of uh, battery life. You know, Sherry, I'm a bit surprised. 2700 milliamps, you know, something, a phone this big, you would kind of expect something like 3000 or 3000 plus, yeah. but uh, you never can judge a phone by the battery size. It's about the performance, how efficiently it is being used. Another thing that I like, you know, being that it is an Xperia phone, you're going to be familiar with the button, the power button, which is right on the side, and, and you can feel it. As you move your hand, you can feel exactly where that power button is, almost in the center, but just a little bit off to the left. On the bottom of the phone, the bottom right corner, you'll notice there's another dedicated button, and that's for the camera, because Sony is known for their cameras, and you can use this just like a typical point and shoot and take photos by pressing it just like that. That's right, Sony phones have great cameras, and this one is no exception. The main camera is 23 megapixels, and the selfie camera is 16. Now, that's pretty impressive, a 16 megapixel selfie cam. It also ha features a wide-angle selfie camera lens, which is important because the last thing you want to do is just take a bunch of pictures of yourself. Now you can get your friends in it so you don't look like a narcissist. Yeah. Another great thing I like is that it does have dual SIM and micro SD, so you can add additional storage. Speaking of storage, internally you can get the 32 gigs or the 64 gigs version, but dual SIMs, you could use this for, for your work, have a work SIM in it, and also your personal one, or you can even have a travel SIM if you travel a lot, want to take pictures, but keep your old SIM in case somebody needs to call you. Right, you can also add a micro SD card and you know you can have add storage up to 256 gigs. Again, if you are looking for a large phone but you don't want to break the bank, you can get one for under $500, like this, it's from Sony, it's the Xperia XA1 Ultra. Check it out.